to San Antonio Living. There is a show on the Food Network. It's called Cooks vs. Cons. It's all about deceiving the judges. And joining us to tell us a little bit more, Andrew Morgan is here, a physical therapist from San Antonio, a.k.a. a con. I'm a con. <laughs> <laughs> what is the concept behind that show? So there's two professionals, two professional cooks and two amateurs, and you don't know who is who. Okay. Identities are kept secret, so there's no... Uh, higher standards for the professionals, no sympathy for the amateurs. You are completely judged based off of your food. So they are like looking at your your knife skills and your chef skills, and then they got to taste the food and see whether you're the con or the cook? They are watching everything that you do. Okay. Um, from the way you hold the pot in the pan to your knife skills, I mean, they, they catch everything. I, so I'm noticing something here. You've got your, your chef <laughs> outfit on the outside. But underneath, I, I, I do. you get your little physical I've therapy my, outfit I've got my on. on it, so, you know. I love that. <laughs> All right, can you teach me maybe to be a con and fool some people? I, I would love to. Okay. So. Is this what you made on the show? This is the dish that I made on the show. This right. is a uh, gochujang glazed uh, chicken lollipop. So if wow. you think uh, chicken love up, you want to jump in here? Yes. Yeah. Okay. okay. Do, 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 like, like, like this. Hard. Okay, we just clean it all up. This happens with everybody. And so now you're just going <laughs> to dig in here. Oh. <laughs> uh -huh. See, this is the physical thing. I can get in there. No, you know, I'm not so good so that. That's what it does. Aha! Uh -huh. okay. okay. That comes down in here. Okay. Now, I did dig in there with the plot. Okay. So this is the bone. We just set that aside. Now what happens? Okay, so since you're gloved up, I'm going to yeah. have you take take one of these. Okay. Okay, you're going to drop it. And this is just a basic waffle batter. Two eggs, some buttermilk, a little bit of flour. Okay. I've seasoned it up with some Japanese seasoning. 150 Safe. degrees. Be very careful. Slowly. Slowly. Food network junkie. I, mean, um, I know. It's, it's, it's addicted <laughs> to that stuff, too. I, you know, uh, Chef Ming Tsai out of Boston is really, one who really inspired me. Mm -hmm. I actually would schedule my classes in college around his show just to watch so I did not I meet, miss his show. Um, but I'd always wanted to do, you know, a, a cooking show, and when uh, Cooks vs. Cons came up, I, it really intrigued me, and I said, that was really the one for me. So, we're not spoiling anything, because the episode aired last night, but you went home with the big prize, right? I did. I won $15,000. That's amazing! So, clearly, you've got some skills. <laughs> what are you going to do now? Because you got to weigh this. You can go back and continue physical therapy or maybe go to the restaurant. Well, that's the talk of confusion. Yeah. Or confusion or confusion. I love I'm it. actually uh, working on getting a truck up, uh, uh, a food truck up and going. Good. What would you say to other people who are like, you know what, just try something new? Go for it. Yeah. Um, now I'm going to spoon in a little bit of the crema that I made here. Mm -hmm. So this is uh, a little bit of Mexican crema, some cilantro, and a little bit of yuzu. Oh, that makes everything this. better, right? It smells fancy. I like okay. it. Yeah. But that's the finished product. All right. I'm going to tell everybody how to eat up with you, and then I'm going to give that lollipop a taste. That looks okay. absolutely amazing. Guys, if you'd like more information on it, you can uh, find out more at foodnetwork.com. He's also on Facebook, Twitter, and Instagram.